Okay, so today we are covering something a little bit more basic, not that creative, but equally useful because I had to do it on project day and I wasn't sure how to. So what we are going to be doing is linking from an, a menu item to a section on the same page or from a menu item to a section on another page, if that makes any sense. So let's get into it. All right, as you see here, I have six menu items and the first four menu items are connected to a section on this long content page. As you can see, it is a very long content page. Yeah. Let's test it. So about plans, FAQ and contact. All right, all good so far. And if I click on page, it's going to lead us to a page, but to a section on that page. And there you are. So let's see how we can achieve it. And I'm telling you, <laughs> it is so simple. All right, so for the first container, I had to find a, a different solution because whenever I, I was trying to navigate back from the about section or the plan section, I couldn't go back to home. It wouldn't go back. So I added a menu anchor and I gave it an ID of home. You have to remember this because you have to add it in the menu. So the way you would do it basically is go to appearance menu and go to custom links and add the link of your website here, including the ID that you have given your anchor. But don't forget to add the hashtag. So this is the link of my website up until here. Then I added a hashtag and then I added the ID that I have given in the anchor element. And that was it. And I saved, of course, don't forget to save the menu because it happened a few times. I was wondering why it's not working because I didn't save it. Now let's move on to the other sections because the other sections are quite easy. So the only thing that I did is basically I went to advanced and I added a CSS ID right in the CSS ID box and I did the same thing for each section as you can see each section treated in the same way and very very super super easy you simply create another custom link and you put in the hashtag and the ID that you have given that section and that's it as simple as that and of course don't forget to save the menu and the last menu item as I said before this one leads to another page but to a section of that page and the way you do that is basically go to that page go to edit that page and grab the link super easy again and go back to your menu and this is the custom link you create another custom link and you add the link of the page together with the ID of that section if that makes any sense it's basically the same thing that we did earlier with the other menu items we just add the link of that page and don't forget to add the hashtag and that is it I think it's super easy let me know if you have different solutions for this kind of things if you would like to know what else you can build with Elementor watch this playlist here and if you have gotten any value out of this video please consider subscribing liking and sharing this video and I'll see you next time.